Hi, Timothy Unger here. In this video, I'm going to use list interpolation to first create a list of even and odd numbers. So I'll show you how list interpolation works. And then uh, we'll use it to solve the FizzBuzz challenge. Now, I know I've talked about FizzBuzz a lot uh, on this channel, but I've never used Python list interpolation to solve it that way. So it's another way to solve it. Uh, I'll show you the traditional way as well. Um, or you can fast forward through that part if you're not interested. All right, so first off, let's start off by creating a numbers list from 1 to 100. I'm going to do that. I'm just going to unpack a range from 1 to 101. And then uh, what I'm going to do, so that's going to give me a, a list of numbers from 1 to 100. The top on the range is exclusively included, not inclusively included. So uh, it won't include 101. It'll include the last number will be 100. Anyway, so if we want to create an evens list, what we can do is we can use some list interpolation. So we can say number for number in numbers list if number, and I'm going to use a modulo symbol, modulo 2, if that equals 0. So what that means is if the remainder of the number and 2 is 0, uh, then it's an even number. Right, and so we'll put it into this evens list. We'll also create an odds list, and we'll say number for number in numbers list if number modulo uh, two does not equal zero. Okay, and then I'll print the evens list and print the odds list. Okay, and let's just build this. And we see we got this first list here, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, all the way up to 100. That's our evens list. And then the second list, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, so on, all the way up to 99. That is our odds list. Okay, so we've done that. That's pretty nice. Um, I'm going to just comment this stuff out. And now I'll, let me show you the FizzBuzz challenge. So the FizzBuzz challenge is... Uh, you want to output a list of numbers, so something like 1, 2, and then if the number is divisible by 3, you do fizz, uh, 4, 5. Uh, actually, if it's divisible by 5, you do buzz, so, and then you would do fizz, because 6, and then dot, 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 up to 15, which is divisible by 3 and 5, you do fizz buzz. And then you would keep going all the way up to 100, which is divisible by 5, so it would be bus, right? So you go from 1 to 100. Um, so to do that traditionally, we'll do a for loop, so for i in range, um, let's say 1 to 101, because we have to go one number above, because the 101 is not inclusive. Uh, we'll say if i modulo 3 equals 0 and i modulo 5 equals 0, we would print fizzbuzz, um, and then, and actually let me just do this, we'll do this all on the same line. So we'll say the end here is just a comma and a space. And then um, I'll say if i modulo uh, three equals zero, we'll print you know, fizz, end it with a comma and a space, and then uh, and actually, we want an elif here. My bad. And do another elif uh, i modulo 5 equals 0. We're going to print buzz. And I'm just trying to get this all kind of wrapped on the same line. And again, the last one is going to have a comma after it. But, um, you know, there's we could put another conditional, wrap this in another conditional saying if it, the number, if i equals 100, just print buzz. But... I'm not going to do that for this. All right, and then we'll just print i uh, end equals comma and space. Okay, and let's build this with Python, and we see that we get it this way. So that if we left out the end with the comma and the space, you know, so after the last one we have a comma and a space. If we left that out, it would just be you know one per line. This is just easier to see for the video. Okay, so that's the traditional FizzBuzz challenge, but let's do it with a list interpolation. Okay, so I'm going to get rid of this stuff, and let's first uh, create a list of numbers that are fizz numbers. So we can say for number, and we're going to print number for number, our number for number in numbers list if uh, number 
modulo 3 equals 0 and number modulo 5 does not equal 0. So we're doing this a little differently. Uh, the buzz list um, will say number for number in numbers list if number uh, modulo 3 this time does not equal 0 and though the number modulo 5 does equal 0. Okay, so that's the buzz list. And then the fizz buzz list is going to be uh, number for number in numbers list if number modulo 3, if that equals 0, and number modulo 5 equals 0. Okay, let's build that up. Uh, actually, oh, before we do that, let's print them all out. So we'll print our fizz list, we'll print our buzz list, and we'll print our fizz buzz list. Okay, and let's run that. And we'll build. And so we've got the fizz list, which would be 3, 6, 9, 12. We skip 15 because that's divisible by 3 and 5. Uh, 18, 21, 24, 27. Skip 30 because that's divisible by 3 and 5. And so on, all the way up to 99. Then we have the buzz list. This is only divisible by 5, not 3. So we can do 5, 10, skip 15, 20, 25, skip 30, 35, 40, skip 45, and so forth, up to 100. And then we have the fizz buzz list, 15, 30, 45, 60, 75, 90. Okay. Um, now, that is uh, one way to get each list. But if we want to actually print them all out, like fizz buzz, like the challenge, we can do that with list interpolation and conditionals as well. Okay, so let me just get rid of this stuff, make some room. And okay, now I'm going to create a uh, list that I print out where it prints out fizz, buzz, fizz, buzz, all in the same list along with the numbers. So I'm going to call this list fizz, buzz, and I'm going to say we're going to print out fizz, buzz uh, if number modulo 3 equals 0 and number modulo 5 equals 0, else fizz if number, this is going to be a long line, I'll fix this with uh, auto pep, 8 number modulo 3 equals 0, uh, else buzz if number uh, modulo 5 equals 0, and then else uh, number for number in numbers list, okay? Now let's uh, print fizz buzz and let's build this. And we get it. So we have one, two, fizz, four, buzz, fizz, seven, eight, fizz, uh, buzz for 10, 11, fizz, 13, 14, uh, fizz buzz for 15, 30, 45. Uh, and we get all the way up to 100, which ends in buzz because it's divisible by five. So that's how to do fizz buzz with list interpolation in Python. Now, uh, if I wanted to format this, uh, I could CD, so you can see it. So I'm in the directory. And um, what I can do, let me check the file name. So this is list interpolation fizzbuzz. So I can say something like auto pep eight, uh, dash dash in dash place um, and then I'm going to do list interpolation fizzbuzz.py uh, hit enter and now if I open this file you'll see that it's been formatted uh, so that if I turned off word wrap let's see here, here uh, we'd get the formatting so the lines aren't longer than 80 characters so it just wraps the line Anyways, I hope you found this video interesting. If you did, please give it a like as it will help get out to more people. Also consider subscribing as it really does help the channel grow. I want to thank you for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.